Good morning, Saturday, July 24th, 2021. Episode 116, Chuck Klein, Hall of Fame, 1928-1944, 17 years, 1,753 games. Missed a lot of games in 17 years. He's averaging about 100 games a year. 6,486 at-bats. 1,168 runs scored. That's pretty good. 2,076 hits in 1,753 games. More than a hit a game. 398 doubles. That's good. 300 home runs on the nose. 300. 1,201 RBIs. That's pretty good. 1,700 games, 1,200 RBIs. Very good ratio. I like this stat. 320 lifetime batting average. How many times over 300? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven times out of seventeen years. Boy, if you get ten, three hundred batting average seasons, you're good. You had eleven. How many times over one hundred RBIs? One, two, three, four, five, six times. Very good. He had a high of 170 RBIs. How about this stat? How many times over 200 hits? One, two, three, four, five times over 200 hits. Listen to this. He had 250 hits as his high in one season. 250, the record for 154 games is 257. And then 162 game season is 262. 257 by George Sisler, 262 by Ishiro Suzuki. Chuck Klein, 250 hits. Then another season he had 226. And another season, he had 223, and then another one, 219. This guy can hit. All right, let's look at his let's look at his uh, production. Comes in 1928, 23 years old. Plays for the Philadelphia Phillies. Then he played for the Chicago Cubs. Comes in 51 hits, 360 average. All right, 64 games. Following season, he breaks out. 149 games, 219 hits as 24 years old. That's 356. Chuck Klein, you heard of him? I didn't know about him. 1930 season, this is his best year. 722 at-bats. He scores 158 runs, compiles 250 hits, that's just 200, 250, 59 doubles. The record is 67 by Earl Webb in one season. 40 homers. A hundred and seventy RBIs. And he bats three eighty six. This is the nineteen thirty season. All right. The second season. Two hundred nineteen hits, forty five doubles, forty three homers, one hundred and forty five RBIs. Bats three fifty six. All right, that was in nineteen twenty four. So he really breaks out. In his second year. Sorry for skipping a little bit. But I got the glasses and I'm looking at the board. Sometimes I miss that one line. 
All right, so I'll just highlight. This guy's important, Chuck Klein. First year, he bats 361, but he only played 64 games and got 51 hits. Second year, he plays 149 games. 126 runs scored, 219 hits, 45 doubles, 43 homers, 145 RBIs, and bats 356. That's his second year. But the third year is his best. 722 at bats, 158 runs scored, 250 hits, 59 doubles, 40 homers, 170 RBIs, bats 386. What a year! Nineteen thirty. He comes back and and scores a hundred. Nineteen thirty-one. I'm sorry. Comes back after that year. Hundred twenty-one runs scored. Two hundred hits on the nose. Thirty-one homers. Hundred twenty-one RBIs. He bats three thirty-seven. Nineteen thirty-two. Comes back. 152 runs scored, 226 hits, 50 doubles, 38 homers, 137 RBIs, and bats 348. 1933, 101 runs scored, 223 hits, 44 doubles, 28 homers, 120 RBI, 368 batting average. 1934. Four, comes back, he missed 50 games. So his production is down from 223 hits. He goes to 131 hits. 20 homers, 80 RBI, 301 batting average. 1935, again, he missed a lot of games. So he bats 293. 1936, he comes back, 184 hits. 25 homers, 104 RBI, 306 average. 1936, missed a, a lot of games, so 254. 1936, he split the season. All right. So two, 294 with the Cubs, but then he goes and plays for the Phillies, plays another 117 games. So he does bat 309. 1937, 325 average. 1938, 247. 1939, 284. 1940, 218. Had a down year in 1940, 36 years old. And then uh, 42... 1942, 43, and 44 didn't play very much. What I, what, what I want to highlight is that in about 14 seasons, because three of them were not that many games played. So in 14 seasons, he gets about 2,000 hits. He's on pace for 3,000 if he plays 20 full seasons. 300 homers, so he's on pace for about 450 homers. And then he would have been over 1,500 RBIs. And then his lifetime batting average, 320. But listen to this. This is how he starts off. 362, 356, 386, 337, 348, 368, 301, 306, 309, 325, 300. He was lighting it up. And then the hits, 219, 250, 200, 226, 223. And then he had 184. What do you think of Chuck Klein? I'm impressed. Especially with that 250 hits in one season. Are you kidding me? All right, I spent a little more time on Chuck Klein, Chuck Klein just to highlight what a player this guy was. All right, here's another player you probably haven't heard of. Next next episode will be Bobby Wallace, Hall of Fame. Thanks for watching. I'm out.